welcome back. It's This Morning Today, hosted by me, Kate Thornton, and, of course, Peter Andre here. Well, I have to say, it's taken to this like a Dr. Water. I am, I'm starting to feel really comfortable. In a minute, I'll be snoozing over on one of the couches. I'm <laughs> no, I hope not, too. Someone just said in my ear, I hope not. They were right. <laughs> That'll be the voices. Um, how are you feeling? Uh, well, I'm fine, Pete, but then, you know, I'm not as new to this as, as you. You've never done live telly like this before. No. And, uh, <laughs> and you were really nervous this morning. You were I in was, at half yeah. seven, prepping and being a consummate pro. I was on Twitter last night as well, and I was just Twittering people saying, I'm reading through my script and I had to get an extra coffee. And I mean, I think I'm completely wide on coffee because I had it all last night, I've had it all morning. I feel great. Oh, and you know, just as we came on air, he was jumping up and down like an excitable child. Yes, I was. And the music came on and he was, ooh. But well, that's because I saw you. Oh. That's the truth. You're a charmer. You but won't be single this, for we'll longer lines like that, trust me. Can I just read this, actually, because um, uh, Oliver Mottram, it's his birthday today, and I want to say happy birthday to him. He's eight years old today, and apparently he's my biggest fan. And Aww. so I'm sending you big birthday wishes and I hope you have a great time. And Mum, let him stay up and watch whatever he wants and eat whatever he wants tonight, please. Okay. Just this once. Well, still to come on the show, the scariest <sighs> Halloween costumes on the high street, plus the ultimate garden makeover. But first, last Sunday, we sent Alison Hammond backstage at The X Factor to get up close and personal with Michael Bublé. And boy, did they get personal. <laughs> <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen. Oh, she is funny, eh? She She's is brilliant. Funny. And uh, for more on Michael Bublé, including details of his tour, please see our website. That's itv.com slash this morning. Yeah. Oh, dear. How does she get people to do that? And I don't know. I mean, I would never do something like that, put something like that down my pants. I think that's ridiculous. Give me the mic back. <laughs> OK. Uh, yeah. Hey, at least I've got a name for it. <laughs> Mike. Oh, okay. dear. Anyway. <laughs> Still to come, from spooky sailor skeletons to wicked witches, we've the latest Halloween costumes for your little terrors. Plus an X Factor exclusive with the mighty Simon Cow. See you after this. <laughs> all the kids, and that's all. A call from Mr. Ranson. Do you want to tell us what happened there? How this. I'm looking forward to it. Okay, still to come, Beverly Knight sings live, plus Rosemary Schrager cooks up some Halloween harrows. And don't forget our exclusive with X Factor's Simon Cow. See you after this quick break. Welcome back. Still to come, Simon Cowell reveals what he really thinks of the X Factor twins, John and Edward, <laughs> plus Beverly Knight sings live. But first, it's competition time, so how do you fancy winning yourself a fabulous £25,000? Wow. Work. Thank you very much. I, like, saw you know him, I saw him smile at the end. Yeah. And well, he pays yeah. a lot for those teeth. <laughs> <laughs> ah. Okay. Ah. Do you know what, though? I remember that Alison Hammond audition very, very well. She was very, very game. She really was. She does well, crack me up. I'm Pete, that's it. it. We're almost done. I know. Do you know what? I've loved it today. And I love Philip and Holly, but I'm going to see if we can just kind of not let them in <laughs> next week. We'll have to get both Ruth and Eamon first. <laughs> no, yeah, of course. Uh, it's, it's been a pleasure. No, it's we been have... really good fun. We've been a, been a half-term treat, haven't we? Yeah, I have. And, and oh, my God, Rosemary. <laughs> I, lo I love... I actually... No, I love Rosemary. Good. I think she quite... <laughs>